you don't owe them nothing. You don't have to prove yourself to anybody. You got a lot of people out here chirping right now talking about how, oh, I see it when I believe it. They're going to have to prove it to me. I, 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 I understand better when I see it. I don't see it happening for them. Mm, I, they got to show me better than they can tell me because I ain't trying to hear that stuff they talking about. You got people feeling like you got to prove something to them. And you ain't got to prove nothing to nobody. Somebody out there feel like you owe somebody something. You don't owe nobody nothing, bro. That's real talk. People always got their hand out. When somebody come up, when somebody change, when somebody doing something different with their life, maybe making a little extra money, whatever they doing, people always going to have their hand out feeling like you owe them something. Feel like you need to take their hand and take them with you where you going. Like, and they don't want to do nothing. They just want to go for the ride. They want what you got. But... You got them feeling like that you need to prove it to them first before they even believe in you. What kind of shit is that? You ain't got to prove nothing to nobody but yourself because that's the game of individuality, my friend. It's all going on within you. You only got to prove yourself that you the shit. You only got to prove to yourself that you're powerful, that you can believe in yourself, that you can trust yourself, that you can make accurate decisions. You can believe that. You know what you like. And you can learn that. You can discover that. You can prove things to you because there's things that we've experienced that made us feel otherwise. So now the only person that needs to be proved something to is yourself. You, me, myself, and I, yeah, that's all it is. You feel me? It's you. It's an individuality thing. Prove to you what you can do. You don't have to do it to show other people. To make people feel like, I know, like me, I felt like one day I'm going to show these mother, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to prove to them. This is how I felt. It came out like, I'm going to prove to them one day who I am. And, I, and it's just like I kept feeling like I never would, you know, succeed in anything because I was doing it for all the wrong energy, all the wrong thing. No passion, no motivation, no inspiration, nothing toward it. It's just like, I got to prove these motherfuckers right. Because I knew there was something inside of me. I knew there was some fire in me. You know you got some fire in you, some drive in you. You got something in you. You can feel it lighting up, baby. You probably feel that shit right now. Reminds me of a candle being lit. You you lit. Every day you lit. You feel me? Lit ain't got nothing to do with the, what that song say. I even though I love the song, but the lyrics got to go because it ain't got nothing to do with being lit in my book. But I use it that song for my advantage. You feel me? You lit every day. You on fire with desires, with things that you want to create. And you getting it. But that's the only person you proving it to is you. So when somebody tell you, you got to prove it to them. Oh, I believe it when I see it. Yeah, just walk away. It's a waste of energy, a waste of time. You basically just telling me you don't believe in me and that's fine. But I ain't got to prove shit to you because when you try to do, you be on your journey creating and you try to prove stuff to people, you be starting to come very impatient. You try to rush things. You start running to a lot of blocks. You start like feeling down. Like you start to feel down about yourself. You start to feel like you got to hurry up and get it done because you like doing it to like prove to them. So it's like a rush thing. That's why I'm feeling like, oh man, let me hurry up and get this done. So I can show them all. They got me messed up. I'm going to do this stuff right now. So they going to see this. You know what I'm saying? It's all done for the, all the wrong reasons. And it's crazy. So I wonder like now, because that was me. I wonder, like, was that a setup to make me be like that? And, like, and they also built up some hatred toward those people because, like, they didn't believe in me. And they looked at me like that. They belittled me because of my struggles and because of my temporary defeats and failures. Because I was always from job to job. I had 33 jobs, y'all. Check out my 9 to 5 jobs video. I had 33 jobs because I ain't taking no shit. I leave. You feel me? <laughs> And so I got judged for that. I had so many, I, bro, I'd invested so many different businesses that failed. They didn't work out. But every time you learn something from that shit, I'm going to make a video over why people look at us as failures. Every time you learn something from that shit, and that's real talk. So that's what they see happening. So they judge you for that. You shouldn't be judging nobody. You feel me? That's the problem right there. So they feel like you got something to prove to them. And it's funny because whenever they see it and you ain't proving it to them, you're doing it because you love you, because you're doing what's best for you, because you know what you want, you're going after and you're going to get it. When they see it, they ain't going to be saying that shit no more. They're going to eat them words. They're going to eat that shit. Oh, prove it to me. After you prove it to them, they're going to keep probably raising the bar, but like, oh, that's all they got? Oh, that's it? Mm, that ain't nothing. Nobody don't want that. Who want to live like that? Mm, not me. You know what I'm saying? I ain't never going to make them happy. That's why this journey is about making nobody else happy but you. Happiness lies deeply within you. Joy is within you. It's a state of being. You can shift to it at any time, bro. You are a creator. You're a powerful soul. 
Man, real talk. You change like the phases of the moon, bro. Real talk. They don't know about that. They only know comfortability, which kills all dreams. You feel me? It's killing. Comfort kills. Nobody wants to stay comfort because you already know how life is. If you stay in the same place for year after year after year, you already know what it's going to be like. You've seen it every day. You've experienced it. Like me, I've experienced it. And, I, and you know what I'm saying? That's why people experience what they call bored. And we shouldn't even be bored because we got a lot to do. We got a lot to work. We can always do some spiritual practices. We can always do all types of things. We don't have to be bored. They get bored because they do the same shit all the time. When you're in a comfort zone, you're going to get bored. You know what I'm saying? That's when you get bored. You start doing some shit you probably didn't want to do. Go around some people you don't even want to go around. You feel me? Because I know one thing. Shit, I got to always make that time for myself. My soul always got to show me, hey, it's time to do this. Let's take a chill. You feel me? <laughs> Let's take a break. I never get bored. I always got some things to do, some things to work on. I know how you feeling. I know somebody like, I feel you, right? Ain't no time for boredom. You getting it in. But you ain't never got to prove nothing to nobody. You see, and also I feel like people are feeling like God don't see that, see what you're doing. God see everything. Don't nothing go unnoticed. The universe see it all. Everything you're doing, it's all happening for a reason. Wherever you are, you are there for a reason. It's all happening the way that it should. So accept it. Accept it as it is, baby. Things will change for you. Okay? Straight up. I even got a message over that. I got to drop that video. But you don't have to prove none to those people who feel got their hand out and feel like you got to show them something. You ain't got to show them nothing. They don't care anyways. All you got to show them is what love is. Send love to them, baby, because they... They don't know what it is. They messing with the chosen one, man. This is the wrong person to mess with. Somebody who been through the darkness and found the light, bro, and calm, bro. Move around with all that. And I, I had to get this video because a lot of you feeling like you got to prove something to some of your parents. I'm hearing mother, father, cousin, grandparents, aunts, uncles. You feeling like you got to prove something to these people because they looking down on you. Because they belittling you because of where you are right now. Because of what your past circumstances were. Whatever issues that you experienced. The things that you went through. The choices, decisions that you made. They judge you for that. That's why it's tripped out. We should never ever judge people because we don't know what the hell somebody got going on within them. You don't never know what somebody thinking either. That's why the stuff going on like it is in this world. But anyways, I'm going to make a video over that. Anyway, so they judging you because of, of, of your own journey. Why are people be worried about other people's journey? I don't know. We've all been guilty of that. But people, we you know, like try to control us to be who they want us to be. And they don't like accept us if we don't do it. But they, so then they turn and look at our journey and judge us for it. And, and they've already, like, now got us, they, in their mind, their perception of us is a failure. The way they look at us is, like, they're never going to be shit. They're never going to do nothing. And that's crazy, bro. That's crazy the way things are, right? Many of you experience exactly what I'm talking about right now. Or some of you, I'm feeling like they say, 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 spirit, I'm going to say it. It say, many of you are experiencing this right now. You're like, thank you, Kelly. This is confirmation. You are so welcome, you beautiful soul. You are beautiful inside and out. They want you to be somebody you not. So keep being you and doing you. You don't got to prove nothing to nobody but yourself. Once I started focusing on what I had to prove to me and what I had to prove to the universe, because I built this trust to the universe, like, hey, into the spiritual world, my spiritual team of divine love and light, I built a trust with them. The people who rocking for me, they know me deeply. The spirit world of love and light that I work with, my team, they rock with me. They understand me. They know what I want. My higher self knows my path. That is my authentic self, my higher self. And that's why I stay tapped into it. And that's what I did. I had to prove to them that, hey, I'm going to stay going with it. I'm not going to give up no more. I'm not going to just, you know, have uh, temporary fate, wishful thinking. You know, like, uh, I'm not going to do that no more. You can trust me. You can trust me with these things. You can trust me with this and that and the other. Whatever I, I, whatever I was going through. That's the only person I had to prove something. The only, you know, energy of the spirit world that I had to prove something to was the universe and, and, and my team. So that they know that, hey, I'm ready. I'm going to call on you. I'm going to keep going and say, stay connected with me. Say, let's do this. You feel me? That's who got your back. Real talk. Whoever your source is, who you call source, who you connecting to, that's connected to your intuition. You ain't got to prove nothing to those naysayers. That's the word that's coming to me. You ain't got to prove nothing to those people. It doesn't matter. Take the labels off. I'm hearing it, but it's my family. Take the labels off, yo. It doesn't matter. Everything is energy. 
Everything has a vibration. Albert Einstein said that. Hey, say, check this out. You ain't got to prove nothing to nobody, only to yourself and to the people in the spirits of love and light that I just, in the universe, you know, your source that I just explained to you in this video. And that's real talk. And I wanted to really get that message out there because I, I struggled with it for a long time because it was really a void in my own heart that I realized that I was feeling because I didn't feel happy with where I was and where I was in life and how life was uh, treating me and how life uh, was, you know, my journey, how it was set up how many times things didn't work out for me all those things made me and people how people look down on me was affecting me and that's what made me want to prove something to somebody and once i stopped worried about trying to prove something to people it just started happening and like that video i just dropped today over uh they shot the new you new big growth they they never thought it was you they thought it was them nope not you you know i always knew one day that it would happen like this yeah that was a very powerful inspiration inspirational video because I felt that and this was in the time when I was trying to prove myself to others who looked down on me who never thought I'd be shit because of that affected me made me want to prove something to people so I really wanted to let you know what it really was on this video today I love you guys y'all already know what it is I'm here rocking with you ain't got to prove shit to nobody be you baby keep shining bright if you like this video you find messages here if it's resonating with you smash that like button right now baby it helps grow the channel and it helps get these videos out to more people like us like-minded individuals chosen ones light workers star seeds earth angels those who resonate with these messages baby as I'm building this platform up 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 yeah we going up 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 and we you know all saying we rocking together here on this channel understand each other share our experiences and our stories baby i'm rocking with you i believe in you you believe in you you don't got to prove shit to them say if you feel like you want to share this video share this video with someone you want to share this video with. it's coming to i'm gonna say you can spirit say share this video with someone who feel like you got to prove something so they can see you ain't doing this for them this your journey individuality you hear <laughs> i did it spirit so i'm just being obedient that's the message you guys okay but you know do what you want share this video with who you want to share this video with and keep shining bright, you beautiful, lovely souls. And before I go, if you find the messages here and you're watching my videos and they're resonating with you, I greatly appreciate you if you go ahead and subscribe to the channel, baby, because it helps grow the channel. And also, you can join the Pure Clarity Mindset family with Miss Kelly Travel Spiritually, baby, and these beautiful, lovely souls on this beautiful platform because I love you guys. You're amazing. This is an amazing community. I'm so grateful for each and every one of you, baby. On this channel, we're getting our mind right, baby. And I'm spreading awareness, love, and light each and every day. I love you guys. Keep doing your thing out there because you shining bright. You making a difference in this world. Remember, we have to be the change we wish to see in the world, which means we have to save our own selves. Each individual person has to save their own self. That's just real talk message. Come back to see me because Miss Kelly Travels Bridge is checking out. Peace, love and light to you beautiful souls.